Well, welcome to this combined value med and UK drug testing product demonstration video. We seem to be doing these an awful lot these days because we're introducing so many new drug test combinations. And here's one of the latest ones, UK drug testing, foil branded. This is the seven panel. We've called it the Gen Z workplace. And let's run through why we've come up with that name. Beautiful reverse instructions on the foil, giving you uh, simple to follow instructions how to run this test. But it's the combination that really gives this one its edge. This is a multi-panel seven drug urine dip card and it screens for cannabis, cocaine, LSD, MDMA, amphetamine, benzodiazepines and ketamine. Now that combination won't be found on any of our other drug testing panels, cups or saliva tests, but it really does focus directly on a younger generation recreational drug use sort of a combination and will detect things that on a standard combination will go missed. So inside that what you have is one of these, a UK drug testing branded seven panel card with its cover. If I just remove that you'll see the prongs coming out of the base. Coding for each of the drug groups that you're screening for is uh, nicely colour coded along the middle section here and the C and T indicate where your control lines and test lines will form. So to run one of these tests, simplicity itself, collect a fresh urine sample. I've just got a synthesised sample to demonstrate this test for you and you just dip it into the sample just to below those uh, wavy lines can go onto the wavy lines if you've got more sample uh, in your container than I have here. But do not let the, uh, the urine sample touch the bottom of the panel as it uh, clearly reads across there. Dips in the sample for between 5 and 15 seconds. And you will see on this panel, you can see that lateral flow membrane, the pink dye starting to run up here. You can leave it in the sample until the test is complete, but usually what would occur is you'd remove it from the sample and lay it on a flat, non-absorbent surface. What most people tend to use is the reverse of the open foil. So that goes down there. And the read time for this test, as per the manufacturer's instructions, is between five and eight minutes. So what I'm going to do now is pause this video and show you the results as shown at uh, the five minute time band. Well, here we are at the five minute read time and you can see we've got some really nice clear control lines all along the top bars indicating that every single seven column has run correctly. And then we're looking for the presence or absence of the T line, the test line. And we've got nice, clearly demarcated T lines on all of these membranes indicating absolute negative results. You must interpret them as negative even if the T lines are thin and faint and you will see some variance in the colour density and thickness of the T lines from sample to sample. That's absolutely normal and inherent in drug testing. As long as you've got a control line then you can interpret that as a clear negative. If no control line is showing the test is invalid and needs repeating, if at five to eight minutes and you must give it the full eight development time you have got no T line but a strong control line, then that indicates a positive result for that specific drug group. And that should be confirmed using an accredited laboratory model. So there you have it, a very nice, easy, simple to use, giving clear results, seven panel drug test with a modern combination for a younger workforce and uh, suitable for workplace environmental rapid testing. And uh, it's available now from the UK Drug Testing and Drug Testing Kit websites. We'll put a link in the description below, which will take you through to uh, the further details on this specific combination new drug test. Thanks for watching.